in this video we are going to discuss about introduction to operating system such as what is an operating system or how to define an operating system as well as goals of operating system first let's see what is operating system operating system is nothing but uh, operating system is a program we know what is a program program contains uh, a set of uh, related instructions program contains uh, a collection of instructions program means a software so operating system is called as a software so operating system is a software we have two types of softwares are there first one is system software second one is application software application software means if user develops an application then it is called as application software or application program whereas operating system comes under system software so operating system means it is a system software so what is a system software we can use the system we can use the computer in effective manner with the help of the system software operating system is a system software compiler is a system software assembler is a system software text editors or some system softwares such as notepad uh, wordpad all those are system softwares we can utilize the computer in effective manner so operating system means a system software now let us see the definition for the operating system operating system acts as operating system so this is the most commonly used definition operating system acts as an interface between operating system acts as an interface between user of computer user of computer and computer hardware and computer hardware so operating system acts as an interface between user of the computer and computer hardware so without installing the operating system we can't do anything in the computer so a computer is a dummy component without installing the operate without installing operating system we can do in activity or several activities in the computer only by installing the operating system now let us see the goals of operating system so what are the various goals of an operating system mainly we have three goals are there uh, let us see those three goals so goals of operating system the first goal is execute user programs execute user programs execute user programs the second goal is easy to use computer easy to use computer the third goal is utilize utilize computer hardware computer hardware in effective manner in effective manner let us see these three goals now the first goal of the operating system is execute user programs operating system provides an environment to execute the user programs actually operating system cannot execute the program a program or any task is executed by cpu central processing unit that is nothing but a processor okay generally if you take any programming language it may be c or c++ or java or python or c sharp javascript any programming language if we after typing the program if you save the program the corresponding program will be saved in hard disk that is nothing but secondary memory so whenever we save the program operating system saves the program in hard disk during compilation also the program will resides in hard disk only but at the time of execution operating system transfers the program from hard disk to main memory 
Why? Because CPU can execute a program when the program resides in main memory only. CPU cannot access secondary memory. CPU cannot access hard disk. CPU can access only main memory only. So saving the program in hard disk, transferring the program from hard disk to main memory after execution is over. Once again that program will be transferred from main memory to the hard disk in order to save some other program in the uh, main memory. Why? Because the size of the main memory is very very small. Main memory can store only limited number of programs only. Okay. So, uh, uh, so all those things are done by operating system only. So operating system provides an environment in order to execute the programs. Now let us see the second program, second uh, goal. Easy to use the computer. We can use the computer in effective manner only with operating system. As a user, let us assume that we have given some uh, printout. Now it is the duty of the operating system to allocate printer. Uh, as a user, we have uh, uh, we have done some scanning. Okay, it is then uh, now also it is the responsibility of the operating system to allocate scanner to our program, to allocate scanner to our file. So everything will be taken care by the operating system only. We should not worry about that. And let us see the third advantage. Utilize computer hardware in effective manner. So we have various hardware components such as IO devices. So keyboard, mouse, printer, scanner. So all those hardware components will be utilized more effectively only with operating system only. Okay. So these are the major goals of operating system. Now let us see the components of the computer. Computer components. Here computer mainly contains four components. The first component is, so at the top we have hardware devices. Next on top of the hardware devices we have operating system. On top of the operating system we have application software. On top of the application software we have users. So hardware devices already we have seen. So hardware means the physical components present in the computer. We can utilize all those computer components more effectively with the help of the operating system. Okay. So on top of hardware devices we have operating system. So by using operating system we can utilize computer hardware components more effectively. So on top of operating system we have application software. Application software means the programs which are developed by the user. So user develops the application software for their requirement. So according to their requirement they will develop the application programs. So these are the major components of the computer. So in this subject we will mainly focus on the second component that is nothing but operating system. Now let us see what is operating system from user point of view and from system point of view. So from user view and from system view, what is an operating system? What does an operating system will mainly do from user view? From user view, the major advantage of the operating system is easy to use computer. So by using operating system, we can use the computer very, very easily. If you type the program and if you save the program, then uh, so compilation, uh, during compilation, the program decides in hard disk only during execution. It is the responsibility of the operating system to transfer that program from hard disk to main memory. So if we have given some printout, printout, then it is the duty of the operating system to allocate the printer. So if you want to do some scanning, then it is the responsibility of the scanner uh, operating system to allocate scanner to our file. So everything will be taken care by the operating system only. So we can use the computer very very easily with the help of the operating system. Now let us see what is operating system from system point of view. From system point of view what is an operating system. So operating system acts as a resource manager. Resource manager means resource allocator. Operating system acts as a resource allocator and operating system means a control program. 
So operating system, from the system point of view, operating system means resource allocator. Operating system allocates resources to the corresponding program. We have hardware resources as well as software resources. We have mouse, keyboard, printer, scanner. Operating system takes the responsibility of allocating all these resources to the program. Okay. Or we have some software resources also. Like we have programs and files. Operating system allocates files to the program. So that we can perform any input output operation. And operating system controls the program. It acts as a control program. So that operating system controls the execution of the program. So that one program cannot interfere with another program. Okay. So those two programs will be executed separately. One program never interfere with each other. But uh, operating system takes the responsibility of executing those programs concurrently. So this is about uh, some important points regarding what is operating system.